You know, I was thinking about it here after my live stream a couple hours ago that I did over on Kick. I was thinking about it. And I finally figured out why you motherfucking trolls drive every girl that I get with away. It's because you motherfuckers are jealous. You're jealous that the weird guy can actually get somebody that's honest and actually is there. Who actually has a brain and isn't stupid. You know the only reason why half the chicks fucking left me is because of you guys. Half these people that left me that I was with was because of you dumb fucks. That's why. But that's okay. Because you know what's funny? One day the right one's going to come along. And when they do, you guys ain't going to be able to do shit to stop it. Because what you trolls don't seem to realize is that here in the coming months is going to be beginning your downfall. The troll community is done. The troll community is its going to be ending soon. And you guys have to accept that. CBG, Marty, William, Metal Gear Rex, Fed Smoker, all you motherfuckers are going to be done. Your world is going to come crumbling down. And you know what I'm going to do when, with the pieces of your world when it comes crumbling down? You know what I'm going to do with all those pieces? I'm going to rebuild my life back to the way that it was before you guys came in and started fucking it all up. I'm going to take all the pieces of your guys' crumbled down world I'm going to take those pieces, reforge them, reform them, reshape them, and rebuild my life back to the way that I once was. Back when I had an amazing girlfriend. Back when I had a good job doing what I love to do. And I was taking care of my family. I was keeping my nose clean. I was staying on the right track. I mean, if you don't believe me, take a look at your guys' comments in my last few videos. You guys are pissed. You guys are angry. You guys are fucking mad. And you know what? I don't care if you're mad. Because all I see when I look at you trolls is nothing more than a pathetic ass, bullshit ass, fucking band of criminals. That's all I see. A bunch of criminals trying to make a name for themselves off the backs of ruining other people's lives. And that's all you guys do. You ruin people's lives. I mean, you damn near ruined my whole ass career. Thankfully, that that didn't work. I still have something that I can grab onto and rebuild off of. And I will admit, you guys did do a lot of damage to me. You guys did. You guys did quite a bit of damage to me mentally over the years. You guys did physically do damage to me over the years. But you want to know something? There's one thing you guys have not done and that you will never do, and that's break me. You guys have tried countless times to completely wipe me off the face of the earth. Tried to cancel me. Tried to wipe me out like a bad old statue waiting to be torn down. But yet you guys just can't seem to do it. It's so like I told you, you can't beat me. You're never going to win against me. And you know what's sad? 
What's really sad is you trolls having to resort to what you guys resort to in order to make money. I mean, I understand. Everybody's got to hustle. Everybody's got to grind. I get it. But going around bullying people ain't the way to fucking do it. Going around and extorting people like you did to me, Marty. Like you did to me, William. Y'all motherfuckers said they're blackmailing people. That ain't the way to do it. You know what's sad, Marty? At one point, there was one point where I thought you were a good dude. There really was. There was one point in particular where I thought you were a good dude. But then you showed your true colors and showed that you're not a good person. You're a piece of shit. You're a psycho. You're a murderer. You're a bully. You're a slob. You're a piece of shit. And Marty, you're just like all the other trolls. A dumb, fat, overweight piece of shit slob on his way to nowhere fast. And speaking on you other trolls, you know what's funny? The fact that you guys think that I'm not going to win over all this shit. Y'all think that I'm not going to come out on top. But the truth is, I am. I am going to come out on top. And when I do, and I plant that flag at the top of that mountain, and I'm standing on top where I should have been this whole time, it's going to be so fucking sweet. And you want to know why? Because when I'm on top of that mountain, and I'm looking down at you motherfuckers that have tore me down, all I'm going to see is a bunch of little baby ant looking motherfuckers trying to climb that same mountain that I'm climbing and just falling back down again. Falling back down again over and over and over. While I'm up here with my gear, sitting up here kicking it, enjoying my life. Living my best life. Being there for those that need me. Being, you know, hopefully one day soon, you know, a good boyfriend and husband to somebody that wants to be with me. Being a good son, being a good brother, being a nephew, being a good friend. See, while you guys sit here and let greed control you, while you guys let greed and anger control you. I let righteousness, justice, my heart, caring, kindness, understanding, and doing what's right guide my heart. That's what I feed off of. I feed off of good energy and good vibes and good times. You guys feed off of bottom feeding scum ass garbage. Because that's all you trolls are. Every one of you guys is garbage. Every last one of you is trash. There's nothing funny about bullying somebody. There's nothing funny about extorting someone. There's nothing funny about blackmailing someone. There's nothing funny about assaulting or trying to murder someone. There's nothing funny about that. If anything, it's disgusting. And trust me when I say, when YouTube finds out about what you guys have done, fuck that. When the police and the feds And the higher ups above the feds find out what you've done. You guys are going to be in a world hurt because believe me, here soon, here soon they will know. 
And when they do, it's going to be game over for you. Because people like you guys have no place on here. People that bully others, that extort others, that harass, attack, blackmail, slander, physically attack, try to murder, and have selfish need and greed going through their head. People like that don't have a place on this platform. I mean, it's funny. You guys sit there and say that I belong behind bars, right? In actuality, you fucking trolls are the ones that belong behind bars. Not me. I mean, look at you, Marty. You're, what, almost 40? And you're still acting like a fucking kid. And CVG, like I told you, dumb fuck. You ain't untouchable. No one's untouchable. You think that being touched, like, means physically going up and touching you, right? Wrong. Like I said, my boy Sneaky Jim and his team... They're coming after you guys. And when they do, you guys had better be ready. Because what you guys are doing is wrong and it's fucked up. Because trust me when I say, when my boy Sneaky Jim comes after you guys and your guys' whole world comes crumbling down, you guys ain't going to have no one to blame but your fucking selves. I mean, you got somebody like me who is over here doing artwork, doing music, doing game development, was doing streaming, was minding my own business and making money, doing my, you know, my job, my actual job that I had, unlike you guys, not that you guys would know what work is, because half you motherfuckers don't even work, you're lazy as fuck. Hell, I'm honestly surprised that half you motherfuckers made it past goddamn kindergarten, to be honest with you. But while I was over here working my ass off, what did you guys decide to do? Take me out because y'all thought I was an easy target? And you're right, at first I may have been an easy target at first. But not no more. Because, see... The battle that's going on right now between me and all you trolls and all you bullies and all you criminal scum. You know what this battle is? It's like me being a Spartan. Being a Spartan warrior. And you guys being the Persian people that got slaughtered. This is like Sparta versus Persians. You ain't winning against me. At all. This is like me being a U.S. Marine and you dumb motherfuckers being the damn Taliban. You ain't winning. Because yeah, sure, you guys may have your weapons or whatever. But you ain't got shit on me, I'll tell you that right now. Because every move I've been making since yesterday has been carefully calculated and planned accordingly and appropriately to each and every situation. So like I said... You dumb fuck Persian pussies are fucking with a Spartan. And if I were you, 
I turn tail and run before you guys catch a spear to the dome. I'm just saying. You guys have no chance against my Spartan team and me. None. I'd start running. 